As an airline passenger, he landed in Omaha and he could not believe his eyes. You're about to see why. It's what had to do with his luggage. For a week, he's been trying to get answers and someone to take responsibility. Mike McKnight shows us the damage in this six on your side investigation. When luggage arrives at Epley, passengers don't expect surprises, but John Ewing is ripping United Airlines for the handling of his bag. This had to have been going on for a long period of time to rip through this. I mean, what are their safety plans? Is there anybody monitoring their machines? Not only a $100 bag torn open, but clothes inside shredded. Dress shirt, tie, leather coat. I paid $5.54. And London Fog jacket. Witness and friend CJ Freeze took photos. The bag came out completely shredded. I. I didn't even know how to react to it, just seeing the, seeing his belongings everywhere. A $1,400 suit worn to impress clients, now only fit for a horror movie extra. I thought they were preparing me for a zombie walk. Epley's director of airline affairs says a United staffer immediately took a claim and filed it with the airline's baggage resolution center. But John says after a week, nobody from the airline called him to settle up. But less than 24 hours after Six Year Side contacted United and the airport authority, John says he got a call from the airline instructing him on how to proceed in the claims process. John says with depreciation, his estimated loss is $1,700. But United rules could make the offer less than half that. They told me they would pay me up to $100 per item without receipts. And who saves receipts from a couple of years ago? United promises an investigation into how the bag got ripped apart. And after review of John's claim, he will be compensated. The night he landed, customer service did give him a suitcase to take home the shredded clothes. United told me that I needed to return their bag to them as it was just a loaner. John says when he gets fair compensation, the airline suitcase will be returned undamaged. Mike McKnight, WOWT 6 News. Just when you thought you'd seen it all. Yeah. <laughs> At least Traveling. the loaner bag was a nice one. That he has to take back. Well, after a call from Six on Your Side, the director of airport operations talked with United Airlines local manager who indicated the damage wasn't caused by Epley equipment or staff. And that bag started in Washington, D.C. with a connecting flight in Chicago.